sorry, we don't actually have um, rag and bone men in Australia. No, we, do have, we do have bottlers, this gentleman. Yeah, right. Well, we buy rags. We used to buy rags and bones, yes. You used to buy rags and bones as well? We buy rags, yeah. Yeah? What do you call them here? Cream and dark? Yeah, well, the same thing. Anything yeah. at all. Yeah. Now we call the cream the cotton. Yeah, cream and dark. The yeah, there. Cream same thing, is it? Yeah, it's there. Same oh, thing, yeah. No, <laughs> we can start up again. <laughs> All you need is horse and all you can start up again, eh? Yeah, that's right. Put it in one end, it comes out the other end, doesn't it? <laughs> well, what Les does, you see, Harry, uh, where he differs from the English rag and bone man is that they don't actually give you anything on your empties in Australia for yeah, your yeah, fosters, yeah. for your tubes, you see. At least they don't give you them as members of the public. But uh, Les, Les gets something for them, don't you? Yeah, well, yeah. I buy and sell. Yeah. You get five cents, you get ten cents. Yeah, yeah, it was the same, the same old thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. Kind of same. He looks the same. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope not. <laughs> Does he remind uh, you of anybody? No, 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 not at all. But you know, we, we, we've all got the same look out there. The only thing is we wear a scarf. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, like the gypsy... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You, know, you, you wear a band on your arm. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> He's not much like the old man, though, is he? Oh, no, no, he's oh, smashing. Sure. I like him. I like him. Oh, yeah. the old man. <laughs> Although I might get fresh wear bed today and one meal, but... <laughs> How would you like to just take us for a quick run around the block? Oh. Right, oh, get on. Mind? I know no. you've got your best suit on, but. Well, now I have got the rain. Got the rain. Get out. You can go anywhere that you're raining. Okay. He's all right. He's all right. Go ahead, boy. Uh uh, right, sit up, boy. Here you go. Get up. Come on, now. Like this, yeah, I've seen have spent a lifetime. We never oh, it's not a bad, it's not a bad life. I've been on it for about 55 years. Yeah, look at it all. He looks so fantastic, doesn't he? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's not bad. Oh, life. It's a good life. You meet a lot of good people. That's it. We'll go right around for the other joint and go up and round for the market. Get up. Tell me, where did you shoot most of the scenes for the Stepto series? And, uh, around Shepherd's Bush. Run about Shepherd's Bush and around that area. You know. Was it done on a cart just like this? No, our carts no, are a bit a... smaller. This is a cart. We call it what we got. What we call a trolley. We yeah, call them a trolley. Yeah, got rubber wheels. This wheel. is a big. Yeah, this is a bigger. This. Yeah, this got bigger. Rubber yeah. wheels, haven't you? Much more rubber wheels, you see. Yeah. Because you've been playing the the, the step toe character now, the, the character of the son for what? How long? Five, six years? Is it? No, ten years. It's ten years. Ten years. Yeah. Ten years. Uh, where's the other bloke? Is he passed away or what? No, he's in Hong Kong. Now. I'm to go. He's not passed away. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had enough of him, Harry? Have you had enough of Harold Scepter? Uh, no, no, I'm quite happy with him, you know. But there's always one thing you always see. What you see is a great pair of rumps going up and down all the time. You know? <laughs> <laughs> when you have front there, have you see him? Really? How much of um, how much of you goes into Harold Scepter? Where, where does Harold Harold Harry H Corbett begin and, and Harold Scepter leave off? Oh, every morning. When I put the costume on, very little of me is in Scepter. Where do the two characters really differ, Harry, as far as you're concerned? Oh, uh, you know, in every kind of an attitude. I mean, uh, well, he never seems to get the birds. Yeah, well, that's what I mean. That's where we differ, you know. <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't think I'm made. He's got the blooming well, digger. Well, I'm a butler. It's the same thing as you say. Can you fix my daughter up in the top flat? Well, they set you down. You can do the best you can. Yeah, that's all you can do, isn't <laughs> yeah, it? Yeah. We all have the same problem. <laughs> Oh, you get very tired with all those cups of tea, can't you? Oh, I don't drink tea, son. <laughs> this new play you're doing in in Melbourne for the yeah. first time, uh, the character you're playing in this, is he radically different from Harold? No, except for the fact that he's uh, American and he runs a fish restaurant. Oh, but he's right. the same kind of fellow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, same kind of fellow. Exactly. In a um, life like this. You've just finished a new series of Step to England, haven't you? How yeah. long before we see it out here in Australia? I don't know. I don't know. I should think about about a year maybe before we see it out there. You know. 
can you uh, give us a quick inkling of what, what we're likely to see in it? Any new surprises? Because in the last episode, they introduced an Australian character for the last time, for the first time, didn't they? This was your, uh, your yeah, half yeah, brother. That's right, yeah. yeah. Well, uh, the old man's been uh, claiming for a wife on the income tax for 30 years and never told anybody. So you can imagine what trouble we get into <laughs> with the income tax man. What are you, Clay? Oh, well, we be. We got trouble in the family. More or less. <laughs> More or less. Yeah. Get up, get up. My dad started this firm in 1894 and he worked it till the day he died. And I'm going to work it until the day I die. Well, you can work it as far as I'm concerned. 